2019. Collaboration is on every Wednesday, and we get um, 20 less minutes of school. Like school starts 20 minutes later. So it's 6:45. I got to sleep in a little bit, and yeah. So I'm going to turn off my fan and then head to the bathroom to go get ready. I look like an egg. So I'm in my bathroom. Um, I look really bad, I know. I need to turn on my sink so like the water heats up while I go to the bathroom. But first, I'm going to, I just need to throw my hair back in like a bind so it's like my face. My hair, it's natural right now. I don't wear my hair natural to school because it looks like trash. So, I'm going to see you guys when I'm done going to the bathroom. So, sorry for the water bad, but I'm going to wash my face with the red and the red the red except when it's exfoliating wash. So, I'll see you guys when I'm done doing that. Next, I'm going to put the Step 2 Rodent and Fields Unblemish Clarifying Toner on a cotton pad this is what it looks like and I'm just gonna rub it all over my face so, yeah. now I'm going to brush my teeth so I'll be back after I brush my teeth now I'm going to use the CeraVe daily moisturizing lotion so now that I'm done with my skincare, I'm going to do my makeup. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to curl my eyelashes. So now that I'm done doing that, I'm going to use the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. And I put on a lot of mascara, I'm not going to lie, but like that's the only makeup I wear. If you saw my first day of school makeup, I had like a whole bunch of stuff on, but I've gotten really bad acne so I just cut it down to mascara because that's all I really need and also I'm in fit and roll so I just sweat off on my foundation so I'm gonna put this on now that I put down my top lashes on my bottom lashes I'm gonna put the covergirl clump cushion mascara and I'll record me doing this sorry that's just so I'll record me doing this because I literally just do one swipe because I don't like to wear bottom mascara like at all because it just if you wear too much it like makes your eyes look really dark underneath it so I just put one little dash and now I'm going to use this I don't know what this is honestly I just brush up my eyebrows with it and no I don't wear my eyebrows just because it's cool now I just fully and I just smooth it out and I shape it. So I'll be back when I'm done. Now that I'm done doing that, I'm gonna use the Blistex Lip Protectant Medical Lip Ointment and just gonna put it on my lips, obviously. And that's it. So now. I need to do my hair. There's no way I will wear my hair like this to the school and I still look bad because my hair in the outfit is not done. So I think I still need to blow dry it a little bit because my hair is still pretty damp from last night. So I'll blow dry it and then I'll be back with you guys before I straighten it. Okay, sorry about the really bad angle. I have like nowhere else to put this because if I do it like this, you can't see my face but I'm just going to brush out my hair now that it's all dry well I think it's all dried so I said a brush go out and I already turned on my straightener I put it on 392 degrees because 400 like Anything past 400 is like really damaging for your hair. No matter what, straightening, putting heat on your hair <coughs> damages it. But I'd rather it not be as damaged. Like 
four hundred past four hundred really freaking kills your hair. So now I'm putting the Garnier Fructi Style Flat Iron Perfective Straightening Mix. So this is just like heat protector because I do not want to kill my hair because I used to not use heat protectant and I would also have the straightener on 455 degrees and I straighten my hair every single day and my hair it damaged most, all like almost all my hair like I had to cut off over a foot like it was all the way down to my waist and to cut it right here so I do not want that happening again and then I also have highlights which means I have bleached my hair before like I have little strings bleached hairs and stuff so it's important and I don't damage it any more than it's already damaged so I'm just going to straighten my hair whenever this feels like it's hot enough and I will be back with you guys but here's before it's really wavy because and poofy because that's my natural hair so I'll be back when it's straightened so I'm now done with my hair and that took about 10 minutes and here's what it looks like after I'm pretty sure it's pretty straight there might be a wave or two in there but let's see yeah there's a wave like up here but uh, it's kind of hard to get up there to be straightened so now that I am done straightening my hair I'm going to head downstairs to wake up my mom and I need to hold on my head and make sure my straightener was off yes I have to wake up my mom because uh she does not wake up to her alarm so I'm going to go do that look who I found down the stairs my no say hi my no he's sleeping Oh, never mind. He's in a bad mood. So I'm gonna go wake up my mom. So I'm gonna check the laundry room. I don't think my mom did any laundry last night, but I'm just going to check. So my mom did do the laundry. She did dark delicate, so I got my shorts for the day. So let's head upstairs and I'm gonna go and get dressed. Sorry, the camera's so shaky. My no. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm all dressed and do my OOTD. So, I just got dressed, and I'm wearing this Kendra Scott necklace, obviously from Kendra Scott, a Missouri shirt from Imagine That, some Nike shorts from Academy, and then I'm wearing my white vans from Journeys. So, I'm also going to put on my lifeguard hoodie that you saw me wearing earlier, so that I don't get cold. So, I'm going to put on deodorant and perfume. And then I'll head into the bathroom to part my hair. So my hair is parted now. So I am going to head downstairs and then head off to school. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Bye.